Guys, Dave Sand here again, 692020. Well, I got some more harassment from some more sex in inbox com com uh, combots. So uh, they've been putting the comments in my inbox, sexual uh, websites to go to. So I want to tell you who to block so your kids and you don't get uh, tempted to go to it or or uh, get to, so there's so you don't get it give in to. There's a bunch of predators out there that are trying to get you to look at their websites and they're just bots. I don't think they're real people because they don't have any subscribers. I think they're just like YouTube sex combots. So what they do is they've been commenting in my inbox and I'm going to tell you some more names to block so you can go to their username and on their channel and which they don't have really a channel just their username if, if they do leave comments on their block I mean get rid of the comments so nobody will um, be able to go to go to those websites because you don't want your kids or even you or anybody else going to those because it's, it's a bunch of garbage and um, the sexual uh, pre preferences and for, porno places you go to can it's just sinful and it's bondage and it can send you to hell and I don't want any of, any of you going to hell over this it's a serious sin against God and so if you do need, don't know Jesus, accept him in your heart's Lord and Savior. Let him come in your heart's Lord and Savior. He loves you and he died for you. And if you're in, into pornography, he can deliver you from it. I know he can. So I'm going to go ahead and name some of these uh, names of these sex inbox combots. So you'll know, and also they may comment on your on your uh, on your channel, your videos too. So I'm going to tell you some names. The first one is Daniel Mitchell, and so he has a blue D. Uh, you know, circle with the D in it and it's blue. The next one is Kevin Moore, Moore Kevin Moore, sorry, Kevin Moore with a purple K with a K in, with purple circle around it. And so I'm going to tell you again these names just so you'll know and you can look them up and, and block the user and don't comment to them either. Don't say anything to them. Just block them. Don't give them any password or personal information or anything like that. They just want to get you to get in their garbage and get hooked on it. Then you have to pay for it and all that probably, but I just want to look out for you and your kids because this is really wrong what they're doing and uh, it's evil and it's an evil, evil business and the devil's in charge of it and he wants to send you to hell and get you hooked on this stuff like a hook and jaw so to speak like when a, when a fish when you, when you hook a fish you know the, the fish is caught and you bring it in you clean it and you kill it so the devil wants to hook you and bring you in and kill you in the lake of fire eventually so the first name is Daniel D-A-N-I-E-L the last name is Mitchell, M-I-T-C-H-E-L-L, -L, and he's got a he's got a blue D for his initial with a his D with a blue blue color around it. The next one is Kevin Moore, K-E-V-I-N. His last name is Moore, M-O-O-R-E, and so purple K with purple around it. So these are some sex inbox, inbox combots. That's hard to say real fast, but try to say that five times real fast. But guys, uh, guys and gals, whoever whoever this is, if they're leaving comments on there, just block them and don't give them any your two step or verification or your your passwords or personal information. Don't go to their sites because it's it's evil, it's it's wickedness, and I don't want you to get caught in this. It's a horrible business that's going on right now, and a lot of people are getting hooked on too, and uh, it's a bad addiction and. I tell you what, it's like what the Bible says: it's pleasure, of sin is the, there's, the sin is pleasure for a season, but in the end, it's like gravel in your mouth. Eventually, it won't feel good anymore, and it'll just be a bondage and something you do because you can't get out of it unless Jesus sets you free. So I'm just looking out for you and your kids, and I hope that y'all have a wonderful day. And if you like anything I'm saying on here, press subscribe, press the bell. I do. I talk about sex combos. I talk about hackers. I do preaching. I do sermons. I do jokes and comedy. I do impersonations of presidents and um, and singers and um, um, uh, movie stars and entertainers and. I got a bunch of goofy stuff on here and some, some sermons that might help you with everyday life and the things we go through and uh, some stories I made up for kids and for adults. All my humor is, is clean. I try to I do my best to keep it clean because I'm a Christian. I love Jesus and I don't want your kids or you or anybody else to get in this, get into be influenced by bad material. So <laughs> I kind of call myself a comedian. I don't know. I laugh at my own stuff. So you may too. But I hope you all have a great day. And Jesus loves you and you too. And Christ. And I hope you know that I'm on your lookout. And I'm watching out for you and your kids. Have a wonderful day. And Jesus loves you and you too. And Christ. Bye-bye.